number one hit music station. Last hour, we had uh, Judy Gifford Tosh, uh, Kaylee Poulton's mom on the radio with us real quick, along with Senator Richard A. Dollinger from Rochester, Greece and Brighton. And we tried to help out with uh, Kaylee's mom's fight to keep uh, Mark John Christie, Kaylee's murderer, from changing his name in jail. Petitions are out on the website at pxy.com, and we will fax you if you call us with your fax number here at 222-9800. Carson, our morning show behind-the-scenes assistant, was What's getting a bunch of, calls, bunch of calls in the other room, right? We're getting tons and tons of calls. I got calls from Buffalo, even. People that can hear us that are close to Buffalo saying really? that they're going to push their radio stations to check out 98pxy.com and push the petition. Really? Yes. That's great. Cool. So if you're interested, just give us a buzz. Right now, 222-9800. See how you can help? It's easy. We have uh, 60 degrees at 827. Good morning. I'm Steve Hausman with your 98PXY information update. It's funny how an 8% off sale gets us out the door. It is tax-free week again. For the next week, clothing and footwear purchases you make up to $500 are free of the 8% sales tax. The football coach of Franklin High School has been suspended. Ben Nix. He's coached at Franklin 24 years. One of his players died last week during a scrimmage. Nick's must sit while the investigation continues. The best 100 companies for working moms. The new list is out. Local companies on it include Xerox, Kodak, Gannett. This September 1st brings new regulations for car seats. Most new seats will now have to come with a tether strap, anchoring it more securely so kids won't get thrown around in case of a crash. We, of course, have more tickets for Britney Spears coming here at 98PXY. Her first CD has now sold 6 million copies, and that is a record. Britney Spears is the first teenager to sell that many, 6 million. Of course, she and 98 Degrees sing their hits at the State Fair tomorrow night. From Skinny Atlas, he played golf. She worked the crowds. So went vacation day one for the Clintons yesterday. Hey, Beanie Babies fans. There's a tiny note on the Thai website this morning. Thai makes Beanie Babies? Right. It says all Beanie Babies will be retired on New Year's Day. Really? All of them. Company, company brass are not commenting. Huh. Thai.com if you want to see it for yourself. Thai.com. Finally, imagine this. A woman flying from Los Angeles to New Zealand. She feels a little tickle on her legs. Mm -hmm. She looks down. Get this. She saw a rat on her knees. Oh, come on. A rat. And she was flying in business class. The crew looked. They saw the rat running around but never found it. Oh. <laughs> the airline has offered oh. the woman compensation. I just got goosebumps. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Sports at 98 PXY. Red Wings wrapped up their home schedule before 12,000 fans last night at Frontier. 3 nothing though. They lost to Pawtucket. And the Rhinos played their U.S. Open semifinal game in Virginia Beach tonight. Daily number in New York last night, 067. The win four combination four, six, six, five. Ten million dollars in tonight's lotto jackpot. Good luck. In ten seconds, it will be 830 or 98 PXY Futurecast next. Eight ball or nine ball? Eight. Or to arrange a personal campus visit, discover the difference at Roberts Wesleyan College. Good morning, this is Fox Rochester meteorologist Michael Gulderick with your PXY Futurecast. 60 degrees, it is 833, and you are up to date. I'm Steve Hausman at 98 PXY, the number one hit music station. In the and this 15 seconds brought to you by rice Aroni, the San Francisco tree. That is a... <laughs> a Zano helper. <laughs> That's what we need. 98 degrees, Britney Spears tickets coming at the 9 o'clock this morning. Stay there, there won't you? 98 PXY. Yeah, 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 yeah. I am the man. Show me love and what is on my mind. Good morning, 837 on 98 PXY, the number one in music station. It's the beginning of the morning. And darn proud to help out the community today with uh, this, uh, this situation with Judy Gifford. And the killer of her daughter in jail is trying to change his name. We'll get to more details on it in just a second here. 98 PXY. I'm packed and I'm holding. I'm smiling, ceiling. It's 
98 PXY, the number one hit music station at Spisano in the morning. Thanks for joining us. You know, the beautiful thing about being live and locally here in Rochester is to be able to do something for the community. And uh, we did that this morning, I, I think, with uh, Judy Gifford's uh, efforts to keep the killer of her daughter, Kaylee Ann Poulton, is uh, Mark John Christie is trying to change his name to something else. And he committed the crime as Mark John Christie. He should remain Mark John Christie for the rest of his life. A judge granted him permission to change his name without really knowing his situation. And uh, we're trying to help Judy stop that. She's filed a, a petition in court, and we need signatures. So it's on the 98PXY website at uh, 98PXY.com. 98PXY being one whole word. The 9 and the 8 and the P and the X and the Y. Now, Tom Georges is talking to you a second ago. You guys pulled it up in the am, office? As I speak to you, and God is my judge, I am signing it. I just printed it. I'm signing my last name right now. Thank you. As a matter of fact, we just uh, sent it around our office. If you can, here's and, an idea. Hang on. Let me look at the bottom of this. It does, you were telling me, Whoops. on completed return to Spazano in the morning at PXY, mm -hmm. Rochester, New York, or Senator Rich Dollinger. The problem here, Scotty, I don't see it. It doesn't tell me phone numbers on it. It does not show nope. up on the website. Mail it the phone in. Numbers. They mail, it in. mail it in. Yep. You can't fax it back to you? No, they, they need the original signature. Oh, they need the original. Okay. Yes. So what what you got to do, and what... Actually, I'll run it next door to... to uh, <laughs> no, he's right on East Avenue. He's right next door to me. The, uh, the, here's an idea. If, if you're getting it off the website or, or if we're faxing it to you, and we'll still take your phone calls here if you want to give us your fax number, what we're going to do is ask you to, to Xerox a bunch of these off, hand them to everybody in your business, one or two at least to each. They can take them home to their neighborhoods, take one of them, give them to their significant right, others, and they can there. spread it around. How do you, you pronounce the judge's name? Latine? Latine? I Latine? Have no idea. Uh, okay, but it, it says to the Honorable John H., let's call it Latine, or L-A-H-T-I-N-E-N-E, or -E E-N, uh, we, the undersigned, are opposed to the petition of Mark John Christie to assume the name of Randy Alexander McPherson. Mark Christie, who murdered Kaylee Ann Poulton, should not be allowed to assume anonymity because of the notoriety and monstrosity of his crime. It is only fair that this criminal was born, who was born as Mark Christie, who committed his crime as Mark Christie, should have to live the rest of his life as Mark Christie. We also support the request of Kaylee's mother and Senator Richard Dollinger to have this case transferred to Monroe County, where Mr. Christie lived and committed his crime. End of story. Yes. And then you go ahead and print, you put down your zip code and your signature you print your name, your zip code, your signature, and you pass it on. It's easy. Real yeah. simple. And what you want to do, if, if you want to get all the petitions back at the office or where you are, put them in one big old envelope and send them here to PXY or to Richard Dollinger's to the senator's office. And those addresses are at the bottom of the petition. Yes, they are. Thank you so much for your interest. Call us at 222-9800 if it's busy. Call back, all right? All right, it's 844 now on PXY. All yours, DJ. What's going to get in the way, Scotty, is uh, eastbound 490. Clinton goes down to a single lane sometime in the next half hour. They're getting ready to set up cones on it now. Westbound uh, 104 across the uh, Vets Bridge is going down to a single lane also. They're, par they're paving the parkway. Uh, yeah, okay, they're paving the parkway westbound anywhere from 390 to Long Pond. They're going to be in there most of the day. That's what's probably new. Everything else, standard fare. This report brought to you by Aspen Dental and Henrietta. The future dental care has come to Henrietta. Celebrate the new Aspen Dental. Jay Scuddy flies us south with custom dentures from $159. Aspen Dental now open in Henrietta. I don't think we've run the music out in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll update you here at 98PXY, the number one new music station. The meter has run out. <laughs> 844 on Spazano in the morning. If you come from a big family like me, you'll understand me when I say, dinner was war. Prime Outlets, this is shopping. Good morning. All right, whatever. 847 on 90 PXY, Spitzano in the morning. And sunshine, 80. That's your PXY future cast. More chances to bring the spirits, 90 degrees. Tickets coming up. Tonight we dance. Ninety-eight PXY, the number one hit music station, eight fifty on Spazano in the morning. Kind of a special day as we're trying to commit some uh, uh, commit some radio time to a really good deal, a uh, good cause. As Kaylee Poulton's mom tries to keep uh, her daughter's killer from changing his name in jail. Maureen's on the phone. She's been on the phone for God at least ten minutes on her cell phone. Thank you so much for holding. You're welcome. Appreciate it. You're on your way to Buffalo right now. Yes, I am. Okay, go ahead. What's what's the deal? Well, what I was calling for is I had heard it on the radio, and my husband has his own carpet and upholstery cleaning business called Carpet Rescue. We do a lot of advertising on the radio, so mm -hmm. what I'm doing up in Buffalo is getting a hold of the radio ad executives that we know, uh -huh. see if they'd like to get in on this, oh, God. Uh, jump on the bad wagon with us. I've talked to one already. I've got calls out to three more. Oh, and, thank you. Um, Oh, you're welcome. And just all I need from you is just a copy of the petition and as much information as you can get me, such as... 
where he is and uh, what his new name he wants to change. Absolutely. It to. It's all contained on the petition that we are, we uh, um, actually released this morning on our 98pxy.com website. You can pull right. it there or we can fax it to you. You can call us at 222-9800. Real quick, and Maureen, um, I, I have to let everybody know, this is not just a Rochester thing. This is no. something that went nationwide. I mean, Judy Gifford was on the uh, national TV shows. Uh, the America's Most Wanted was, was on the story. There were flyers all up and down the East Coast and into the Midwest. Um, um, due to the efforts of the Rochester people to, to try to get the word out about one of their little kids. And you know what really, I think really made us all really angry is the fact that never has been this much of an effort to try to find a missing person, only to find out that Mark John Christie murdered her that day and hid her body. And we are trying to get this stopped from him changing his name to Randy Alexander McPherson. Uh, if you want this petition, all you have to do is go to our website at 90EPXY.com or we will fax you. Thank you so much, Maureen, for spreading the word to Buffalo. Do, do not forget that this is a nationwide thing. Anyone's signature in any part of the country will be valid for this as we send this off through uh, Senator Richard Dollinger's office. Again, thank you to everybody who helped us out this morning. The community is great. It's, it's wonderful to pull together. If you get this petition, replicate it, get it to everybody you know, get them to replicate it and get it out, get it signed and back to us as soon as possible. There's addresses on the bottom of the petition itself. Okay, final Tom George traffic on 98 PXY. Taking up a crash in Penfield, busy intersection of 441 and 250, Penfield Road to 250, folks. They are sending fire equipment to the scene. Your expressways are back up on speed. Your eastbound 490 at Clinton goes down to a single lane anytime now. The westbound stretch of 104 across the Vets Bridge also down to a single lane about now. And they're paving the Parkway westbound from 390 to Long Pond for the day. This report is brought to you by Mr. Seconds Bargain Outlet. Mr. Seconds Bargain Outlet's grand opening sales going on now in Leroy. And he'll be back with this uh, more on the traffic this afternoon with the mayor here on 98 PXY, the number one hit music station. Uh, been a crazy morning. We'll see sunny days today, uh, tomorrow, and Friday. Maybe a thunderstorm coming in Friday, but uh, nothing really serious for the Labor Day weekend. Maybe be ready for one last couple days off. Thank you for joining us this morning and, and helping the community out. It's 8.54, and tomorrow morning, it'll be Thursday. We'll have our friends in from Comics Cafe. We're going to have more tickets to the Britney Spears 98 Degrees concert right up the day of the show. That's right. The show is tomorrow night at Syracuse. And uh, that'll do it. We'll uh, let Therese come in, and uh, i got to clean this mess up here. You can still call after the show uh, with your fax number. We will take them down all day long for this petition that we are uh, sending out. If you want more info, stay tuned tomorrow morning right here on Spazano in the Morning. On 98 PXY, the number one hit music station. For Steve Hausman and Sandy Waters, Scott Spazano. See ya, bye. There are certain things you can count on around Labor Day. A barbecue, a last day at the pool, and big savings at the Land's End Inlet's Comforts of Home event. The Kodak Max one-time use camera. Small enough to fit in your bag, but big enough to cause a scene. Listen carefully. PXY FM Rochester, an infinity radio station. Spazano in the morning. Ten hits in a row every hour. So hot. 98 PXY. The number one hit music station.